What's up guys, my name is Liam, and you're watching a video from Liam Formats, aka XQ. So, in this video, I just want to briefly mention, if you want to create a YouTube channel, how to do it, and like how to upload videos, and what you should do to make your channel be good. Okay, so the first thing that you want to do in order for your channel to be relevant is add a profile picture. So many people on YouTube haven't done this, and I feel like it's an essential part of being on YouTube. So now I'm going to show you how to do it. Oh, by the way, I'm showing you how to do this on iPad, so it's not going to work if you have something other than iPad. The way you create a profile picture, it depends on if you want like a drawing of something, in which case you go to either the notes app or one of your drawing apps. And then you can tap the pencil icon or create a new note by tapping that button and then tap the pencil icon and draw what you want. Then take a screenshot of it. In the description, I'm gonna have how to take a screenshot depending on what iPad you have in case you don't already know. Or you can take a picture from the camera. Or you can go to back to YouTube and then tap that button or that one, doesn't matter. Then tap take a photo, that can allow you to take a photo. Or you can tap choose from your photos, which lets you choose one of the photos you already have. So once you do that, you'll see that you have a profile picture. Then you could go back to your channel. That's what I did here to make my custom profile picture. I can kind of recreate it right now if you want. Next thing you want to think about for your YouTube channel is try thinking about like what you want it to be about and don't be another a direct copy of an, another YouTube channel that you've seen. I have done that and I really am hating on myself for that. I really feel like I know you guys feel like oh, pfft, I know you guys might feel like I am criticizing myself for that, but I'm just saying, I, you should try to be your own unique self in some way, but don't have it be a bad way, obviously, so don't just let people, so don't just let your YouTube channel just get kind of popular and then everyone just have unsubscribed from it. Don't let that happen. So actually make good videos and have good stuff. Next thing you want you want to do is, um, there's no way people are gonna know what your channel is really about unless you show it. So what you can do is you go to uh, back to YouTube and then go back to your channel, which I already showed you how to do, and then go to the um, that pencil icon. That's where you can change your name, by the way. So if you so you can make your name kind of interesting. And then here in this, and then if you go into description, that's what you want to do. So just like put information about yourself. Maybe put your email address if you want people to be able to contact you if they have questions. Or just put anything that you can. And then, once you're done with that, click the check mark. So then, when people go to your channel and go to the About tab, there will be that thing that you put in the About page. So you can see that's what I have written, and it's it's showing up right there. 
the next thing you're gonna need to do is know some good video editing things so on the ipad in order to do this you can go to imovie and then it might look a little bit different for you but the reason for that is because my imovie got updated so now i have these new features that i used the magic movie a couple times and i kind of like it I have never seen the storyboard, but I'm just going to take a look at it. Okay, so it looks like I can just, like, create some, like, things of, like, some beat presentation stuff. Yeah, that's kind of, kind of useful. So, yeah. So, most of the time, you're just going to want to click movie. And you first want to record the videos you have in the camera. That way you can upload it to, it to here. I'm not going to go over some video editing things because that would take a long time. And not only do I not want the video to be insanely long, I actually cannot make the video insanely long. Because my account is not verified with a phone number. But I don't have a phone number. I'm just using an iPad. So... I won't be able to make custom thumbnails or post insanely long videos. I will be able to in a couple years, but for now, that's something we're going to have to wait for. But you still want to know how to do some basic video editing. The last thing you're going to need for your channel, which is optional, is an intro and or an outro. So you might want to have, like, yourself doing some things or some music. And doing that requires you to be able to do video editing and to have to publish that project you make in iMovie to the camera or photos app. So I'm going to show you how to do that. That's what I do have time for. You go to your project, tap the share button, and tap save video might take a bit it might take a little while depending on how long the movie is but when it does you're gonna see a message that says the movie was exported to your photo library if your battery level is low it's gonna tell you that the battery level is low for sharing don't worry about that just click continue I should warn you that if the video that you have made and edited with iMovie is insanely long, like 10 minutes, then it's probably going to take a long time to upload, and you might want to, um, and you might want to kind of maybe, um, just, like, uh, entertain yourself with something, um, and then just come back to iPad and then see if it's done. And you're also probably going to want to um, have some playlists and um, to organize some of the things that you have or that you use. So you can see I have some playlists that I have made. And if I go into the pencil thing... I can choose to keep my sync playlist private. The only ones that I don't like to keep private are the ones that I have made. So you can see those are gonna show up here, whereas only I have access to the um, the ones that I have made and made private. I can also change that. I'm not gonna go over how to do it. If you want a video on how to create playlists and do stuff with them let me know i'm probably going to do that but i don't have time for it right now because i'm trying to make this video so yeah that is all of the tips that you need for your youtube channel